Like, honest to God, if I had to pick an STD to get, I really don't know. I'd probably pick, um, probably the crabs because they could go away after a while. I really would because the herpes, you got to worry about a breakout and AIDS is for life. It's, 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 it's all scary. Hepatitis C, I think you can cure that. I, I, I believe you could cure, cure hepatitis C, so I maybe won't mind hepatitis C. If somehow you got an STD, which one would you choose to have? Hi, welcome to Cinema Club. I'm your host, Corey Zachariah. And, and I'm the co-host, Angel Princess. So today on Cinema Club, we're going to be talking about the movie Us and the movie It Follows. And it's a special horror episode, and it's also another special episode. And so the special guest that might be showing up is the cinematographer guy. That, that shot um, us, and he also shot the movie It Follows. Oh, his name is Mike uh, Glockinus. I just call him Mike G. So right now we're gonna go ahead and watch a clip um, from our night, our date, I guess, at the movie theater when we went to go see this. Mm -hmm. Can we do D1 and 2? D1 and 2. We can't do that? I don't know those. The handicapped people, this is about handicapped people, this movie. Where was Cinema Club? Did, did you think it was a date that I took you to the movies? I mean, did you take me to the movies? I actually bought my own ticket, so... I offered to pay for know. half of your ticket, though. Um... No, you actually didn't pay for any of my ticket. I bought my own ticket. So well, I, told you I mean that. I, I didn't consider it a date because he didn't actually treat me like a date. So And then he said, Oh yes, yeah, since I didn't buy your ticket, I'll get you a drink at the concession. Yeah, so we walk the, in. The concession stand along was lying though. No, no, no. no. The concession... But let me tell him. So we walk in and I was like, Okay, cool, you didn't pay for my ticket, so let's go get a drink. Then he's like Oh, you know what? The line's kind of long. It's expensive. Well, you know, I invited you to the rap party, you know, because you were in my movie, and then you were just dancing all with Max and trying to kiss him and everything. Um, no, I wasn't so, trying to kiss anybody, actually. We're going to watch it my dancing versus Max's dancing, though, all right? <laughs> I thought your dancing was a bit provocative, though. It was. Your dancing was a little bit much. Promiscuous, kind of. Okay, but it's, you know, it's just dancing. It was a little promiscuous. Okay, so, so it was too much for you then. So why would it matter if I was dancing with Max then? Like... It's alright, though. Like, I had way better moves than Max, I thought. <laughs> the way Max did. He actually knew how to lead a lady when he's dancing. So I, I know how to. You know. Just it don't bust my chops. <laughs> so I'm sending this movie to Cinematic Hell. I'm gonna agree and I'll send it to Cinematic Hell. That's but Jordan cool. Peele, keep me in mind for future projects so alright? The next movie we're gonna be talking about is It Follows. That's also done by Mike Galapagos. Mike G. It's directed by, uh, it's directed by Michael Mitchell. Whatever, I thought it was awful. I thought it was awful. Why did awful. you think it was awful? Well, for one, the acting really disappointed me. For I two, I thought she was an, a pretty good actress. No, the the, the acting was uh, just the dialogue was just shit. It was fucking, you know, my movies aren't like that at all. I fucking try to write a good story and then, well, you know, or not have dialogue. Much so do you not it. like it because of the whole like STD part of it though? No, well, like I, the sex. I know sometimes you get uncomfortable no, in I, sex movies. But are you ever worried about an STD? No, not at all. Actually, you I know. mean, are you worried about them? Sometimes, yeah, because yeah. there's been times. When was the last time you actually? Oh, you don't use protection. I I tried to. I tried to use protection. Okay, so when was the last time you actually had sex with somebody or a thing, or um. It's, it's been probably five years. You know, so, sex is it's difficult. You know, they didn't even make the sex interesting. So do looks STDs interesting. scare you though? Like, have you I'd had an worried. experience with it before? No. No. Okay. No. So, but you're. I'm more worried about getting a girl pregnant. I think. It's all right. It's all right. What do you think? Was that a 